chasing the police every single day. Oh, you like to block people on social media because you don't like their freedom of speech, especially women. Yeah. You're an asshole in the sheets, and I know where you live. I know what your family looks like, and shame on you. What you did to me, motherfucker. Die. Die. Oh, you like to block. Yes. Well, bad for you. Again, thank you very much for hanging out and waiting for me to catch you on the Oh, yeah. I'll show you. <laughs> so, I found him on, I found this, this is what he did. I was pissed, and I told him to take it down. Yeah. And that was back in, what, like 2019 or something like yeah, that? Yeah, that's when my father passed away. Okay. You know, when I'm distraught. Mm hmm I have WhatsApp because my aunt and uncle, and so I can FaceTime their dogs. Gotcha. Give them on. I told them. And this was all? Through WhatsApp. When was this? January 2023. Okay. And that's it. And I did tell them to die, but I shouldn't do that. No. Oh. I know, yeah. I don't even do that. My threats are fine. Okay, so. He's claiming that you're harassing him and it's upsetting him and his wife. and. I don't know where they live. Well, he said otherwise, I guess, in your little the voicemail. I told him to take it down. Yes. However, yes, he can... Play whatever he wants on the internet. Like you can I say whatever you want on the internet. So. I don't know about him. Yeah, he's obviously... A nuisance. Not a nuisance. He exercises his freedom of speech. Yeah, everybody does. Yes, and he does it to the... As far as it can go. Yeah. I know everything about him. So, in reference to whatever mm -hmm. I'm doing, would you be willing to give me... Hello, four, four, eight, can you come? A statement about what happened? I have dyslexia, so if I tell you, I can signature it. You know what dyslexia is? Yeah. yeah. I'm just going like, to swear you in, and then you just tell me, and that's, <laughs> that's it. And then just because he, it's the, the, excuse me. Do you need coffee? No. I need to go to bed. <laughs> the basis of what he's wanting to investigate is on the grounds of a criminal investigation, so I have to also brand, read you your rights. Am I getting arrested? No. Good. Because I'm a good person. Oh, I, I mean, whether you are or aren't, that's oh. besides the point. I'm at the sheriff's office, so. Huh? Up the sheriff's office. I understand, me too. <laughs> <laughs> so, and they help me. They don't bother me. But, if, oh, it's if you want to. I can't force you to put your link to or whatever. If the, okay. me reading you Miranda is not Yeah, I know what that is. Obviously. Cops. Mm -hmm. If that's something that's off-putting to you and you don't want to talk to me, I mean... That's fine. So you're good? Yeah, I can't afford an attorney. Hmm? I can't afford an attorney. Okay. I'm not worrying you. You have to take it out. Okay. Read all that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Read it off on a little handy-dandy card. I take your credit card? Hmm? I take your credit card? No, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm still okay. No, nope, not yet. You can put your head down for now. So, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in court. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before we ask you any questions and to have him with you during questioning. You cannot afford a lawyer. One will be appointed to you. One will be appointed for you before you any questions if you wish. If you decide to answer questions with a lawyer present, you still have the right to stop answering at any time. You also have the right to stop answering at any time until you have spoken to the lawyer. Do you understand what yeah. I'm telling you? And with these rights in mind, are you willing to speak to me? Yeah. Alrighty? I don't know any cops. Friends with a bunch of them. So now I'm just going to do the, the interview side of it. So the current time is... 
2.27 p.m. The same as reference to case number 2408-007807. The location here is interview with 7474 Utilities Road. I'm Deputy Skagg with the Shot County Sheriff's Office. Can you please state your full name and date of birth for the record, please? Elizabeth and What is your current address? Northport, Florida. Are you I'm currently? Oh, excuse me. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Are you currently under the influence of drugs and or alcohol? <laughs> See my face? No, no, no. All right. Do you know what the meaning of perjury is? What's that? Perjury can be committed by telling lies or omitting information while under oath. Basically, I don't telling know. a lie after oh, I swear I don't, you. I don't lie. All right. Do you understand what I explained to you about perjury? Yeah. All right. I've been lying ever since my brother died. So no. <laughs> Alrighty. Prior to taking the sworn statement in the place where under oath, please raise your right hand. Do you swear and affirm the information about to tell me is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Yes, sir. Alrighty. So I guess we can start with. They want all that. Is that? No, that's fine. It, that was forever ago, so it's yeah. not even admissible in reference to, to this. Them. That's so, what I'm gonna do. So, as far as a, so the voicemail, how long ago did you leave that voicemail for him? Was that the tenth of this month? I think so. Okay, so I should have did that, and I apologize for that. I understand. Um, you have to apologize to me, and he was one to me. I don't want nothing to do with him. What was your, I guess, intended purpose for sending that voicemail to him? Uh, you Just him? try to like intimidate him. Okay. And I shouldn't do that. As you, I guess, mm -hmm. you called him some names, and then at the end, you said, "Die, die." Yeah. I shouldn't have did that. Okay. Because I just got frustrated. I understand. What did you mean by when you said die, die? Because I just wanted to, but I shouldn't have did that. Okay. I I know my apology. I understand. And you said you wanted him, wanted him to what? Just honorable. Just tell him to quit. Okay, and that was the intended purpose, and I thought that might bully him into yeah. leaving you alone. Yes. Has he been contacting you? No, because I haven't had Facebook over a month. Because so why would you contact him then if he's not even contacting you? Them, I told him, please take it down, please take it down. Mm -hmm. And then I ended up blocking it. Because the first time I told him to take it down, he blocked me. Because mm -hmm. of my right of freedom of speech. He doesn't like one's freedom of speech. And I know that. And I told him to take it down. Mm -hmm. And ever since then, it's like, on my mind, on my mind. Okay. So, have you, then uh, there was other messages that he showed me. I guess you were like, emailing him, and from his, there was various emails trying to contact him, and then I believe there was a point in time you commented on, I guess, him and his wife's business page. Yeah, I told him. I have it. I want to show you. Sure. Oh, sorry, the internet sucks. No, you're good. <laughs> sorry, that's the best thing I can do. And this is when you were emailing them, or is this... Oh, no, it was on Google Map. Okay. I hope you can... This guy is a stalker. You posted me in the channel, which I told you to take it down. I, never, I can't be, because I have a bad back. Okay. And dyslexia. And I told him I have dyslexia. There we go. Okay, and that's what you commented. Did you comment on it again after that, or any no, other time? That just was one it. time? That was it. And then you emailed him? Several times as yeah, well. Take it down. Do you have the emails on you? Let me find when was the last time he contacted you? I said shame on you, of course. Mm -hmm. When was that? Twenty um, December twenty third. Last year. And then this was this year, last month? Yeah. What did that say? I accidentally did that. So you know me again since I do not know. That was for um, the bill for melts. Oh, so that was an accidental yeah. email? Yeah, yes. Okay, because that didn't make sense to be sending it to him, so. That's it. Where did you find his emails at? Google. Okay, same thing with the phone yeah, it's number. it's all over Google. When was the last time he contacted you? 
That was when he ranted about the police, how they're horrible and everything. Is that my That told him to leave me in the phone. Days, years. That was the week my father passed away. Okay, so back in 19. So he hasn't contacted you in five years. No. So why are you keep you saying you want to leave me alone? I'm trying to tell him to take it down and leave me alone. I didn't understand that, but you said he's, he's bothering you doing this, but he hasn't talked or said anything related to you in five years, and you're still... Yeah, I'm just, no, I'm just wanting it to be done. No, it was yeah, done. He then posted then. me. He, I remember, like, I found, like, what, Eternal Affairs? I don't do that. I was just curious. He posted me, my mom, my father's address, mm -hmm. which he's been dead, and my mom. My mom lives alone. No. And I'm, it's like, I'm protector of my mother. I She's my only parent. And she helps me. <laughs> no, I get it. I mean, I understand you're upset about this, what happened, but I've been like, the continued contact with him or trying to contact him even as far as... I barely do it. But you do it. Yeah. But you don't want him to contact you. Yeah. So why are you contacting When I go to Farmer's Market, I put, I put something else on my face so it won't be all over social media and everything. Mm -hmm. So I don't want... I barely go to farmer's market because of him. I understand. I guess my my confusion, I know you want your primary thing is that you don't want him to bother you. Yeah. And you wanted him to take the post down. Yeah, that's it. And I went to Sheriff's Office several times. Mm-hmm. And they said they can't do anything, they can't do anything. I went to one of their Did you contact Facebook ever? Yeah. They didn't do nothing. Okay. I guess my understand. I'm, what I'm just trying to wrap my head around as far as this goes is, if he hasn't contacted you in five years, and obviously you kind of already knew that nothing was going to happen with the Facebook thing. Yeah, and I just why keep on? I just wanted to inserting gone. yourself in there because like, it kind of was already done. Yeah, and you're the one that's keeping it alive right yeah. now by keep on contacting him. That's how I am. And now we're sitting at the sheriff's office talking about it. Yeah, so. What should I do? Just what you probably should have did five years ago. And yeah. Just, he didn't recognize what you were saying. You tried to go to the sheriff's office. We provided you that we weren't able to help. Yeah. And then she should have been at. Done it all. Yeah. You going out of your way to look for his email addresses and just his phone number. Him. Have you texted him too, or just called him? I texted him, but and then I blocked him. Okay. So I, I, should, I said to myself, I shouldn't do that. Well, that was on the WhatsApp, right? Back yeah. in 19... 2003, I think. In 2003? Yeah. Okay. okay. I go on there because my aunt, like, like you know, she lives out of the way in the island park. Do you have the WhatsApp app still with the conversations on there? Or no, just I deleted it. I deleted it and I screenshot it. Would you be able it, to yeah? share me the screenshots? Oh, yeah. All these cute animals, sorry. Right. No, you're fine. Mm -hmm. I think it's white. Which way? Alright. And this was uh, around this time last year. Yeah. Okay. I'm um, always wait till we're done with the statement and I'll get those from you. I mean, you are kind of wrapping your head around that it probably wasn't a good idea to keep on. Keep on going to that. And then especially calling them and leaving them voicemails. Yeah. Especially just with your intended purpose and all on the phone, you had told me that you intended it to be a threat. Yeah. yeah, I know right now you're saying that you wanted it to be more of like an intimidation thing. Yeah, intimidation. Not like, yeah, I don't like that. Okay, for, just for clarification, I guess, which one do you want it to, were you intending it to be or both or something I put like words harassment. in Do you wanted it to be harassment? Yeah. Okay. I don't harass. You, I go mean, through <laughs> yes, however, you just said you you wanted it to be harassment, correct? Yes. Okay. I, my mind gets confused. I gotcha. That's why I just want to clarify and not put words in your mouth. And yeah, just... you're clarifying that between me so I can understand. So, not a threat, not intimidation, harassment. 
Okay. And I know what harassment leads to. Mm-hmm. I'm not going, I don't want to be in jail or did that. Or did Citizen so County. <laughs> oh, that's it. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. Well, is there anything? Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. Is there anything you wish to add, change, or delete from what you've told me? I just want to just talk. I, I don't go to the farmer's he, market. He, I know. He has stopped. He stopped back in 2019. Now it's your yeah. turn to stop, okay? Okay. Alright, so is there anything you wish to add to what you've already told me? No. Have we discussed anything off tape we have not discussed on tape? No. Alright. Right. I'll conclude this statement. The current time is 2.38 p.m. Turn this thing off. Oh, I know that. Cobb Lodge. Policing the police every single day.